Are you missing something? Looking for something? Tired of everything? Searching and struggling? Are you worried about it? Do you want to talk about it? Oh, you're gonna get it right sometime. So much to be scared Maybe today you find yourself standing on the edge of sort of giving up on church and maybe even God. I've always wanted a connection with God. I've always wanted a connection with church. I didn't grow up in the church, but I knew I wanted that now. Because it's complicated. Oh, you're going to get it right sometime. Watershed is one of the only places that I've ever been to where I've truly felt accepted for who I am. It's been a place where I felt just completely accepted. Well, first I have to give credit to my wife. She came home and described this environment to me, and I blew it off. I said, it's a bunch of crackpots up in there. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thanks, Fred. You can I have said, a seat now. Uh, it's yeah. Not exactly. <laughs> I walked in. I had on a tank top. I felt... Welcome, it was just open hearted, heartfelt, and um, very genuine. That's how you see the world. How many times have you heard? She can't believe a word. I didn't think you could find people like this in a church. Before I came here, I didn't really know what to think about the whole Jesus thing. And I still don't, but I know it's okay to wrestle with those questions and try to understand it. And I feel comfortable here, surrounded by people at Watershed that are willing to wrestle with the issues and trying to figure it out. We move into a neighborhood for seven months and practice kamikaze servanthood. We agree to get down into the lives of the people that we're serving. And we agree to open up our hearts and make room for them in our lives. This has given me a, a different perspective on Charlotte as a community. This really helps me give a sense of belonging to a community, and I didn't really have that beforehand, but I didn't know I was looking for that. Now I feel like I'm really part of this community because of Watershed. When I talk to my friends about it, it's kind of like a bottle of wine and you want to share it with as many people as possible. That's how you see the world.